Now, I think we're nearly ready to <laughs> kick off again. Of course, we're going to start up now with the concert. Uh, the local talent is going to be coming on. I know you're all very uh, looking forward to it. Uh, you're all enjoy enjoying it. are going to enjoy it down there. We have some great acts coming out here. Uh, we'll also have the raffle here tonight. Don't be spared a few pounds. Put a few pounds in the buckets with the raffle here tonight. Uh, for a very good cause. Of course, we're very lucky this year. Uh, all the, the prizes have been sponsored uh, by local businesses here in the parish. So just to give you a flavour, a few prizes coming up later on here tonight. We have a beautiful top prize here tonight. Uh, of a box of USA Sorted Biscuits. <laughs> uh, donated. <laughs> Donated by our local shop, local here, uh, P. O'Leary's. Uh, we have a beautiful second prize of a bottle of Blue Known. <laughs> Donated by our local public in here, uh, P. O'Leary's. Uh, and we have a beautiful third prize here tonight of a pair of reproduction brass handles for the coffin of your choice. <laughs> uh, donated by our local undertaker here, P. O'Leary's. <laughs> uh, so that's a flavour of the few prizes coming up later on here tonight. Of course, we're starting up now uh, with the local talent here now. And of course, we're starting with the quiz. I know you're all very familiar with where in the parish uh, we'll be starting up with that first of course we have our three finalists for the quiz here tonight we have Cameron Lyons, Pat Heffernan and Willie Whelan so we'll be calling up yeah Willie isn't here Fat. oh Willie's here I was talking to him earlier on he's here uh, yeah Willie's here all right Father, but um, he doesn't want to go on in front of the strange crowd there's a lot of strangers in the hall Father. so we're cancelling the quiz now but Oh, no, Father, no. I'm going to take Willie's place in the quiz instead, Father. Oh, that's, that's all right. The, that's the way it is working out, Father. That's fine, right, Willie, Father. Grand ones, we can keep it right, going. Sir. Okay, right, Paddy, Father. thank you very oh, much. Father, sorry, uh, Father. Um, the questions are there, Father. Right, right, sir. Right, sir. <laughs> okay, Paddy. Sorry. Paddy. Yes. Uh, do you know Carmen Lines and Patty? Oh, I do, Fanny. Yeah, will you give him a shout there? Tell him we're in time oh, this morning. Right, Father, Just right, let him know right, to come right, up right. here, Paddy, if you could, please. <laughs> Uh, we're cutting time a small bit now, so if we could ask uh, uh, Pat Heffernan and Carmen Lyons, could they make their way to the band podium, please, uh, for the starting up of the quiz here tonight? Carmen, you're uh, wanted for the we, quiz. Come on out. Uh, Willie Whelan had to pull out. You're wanted, uh, due to you're wanted to stay up for the quiz, Carmen. You're on now. So, Paddy uh, Leary will be taking his place here tonight. Oh, take off your trumpet. Uh, we have, I think we have Carmen. Is that Carmen Lyons? Carmel is talking out there on the sideline. <laughs> Carmel, of course, is representing the parish of Kildickin here tonight. Uh, Carmel is in fine form. She told me she's through to the final now. She's fit. She's ready for tonight. Uh, so, round of applause again for Carmel Lyons. <laughs> so, down the outside there, Carmel, like a good girl. Good girl, down there you go. And of course we have Pat Heffernan, uh, if he's down there, if he's gone out to the tiling, could someone run out for him, please, Pat Heffernan? We have, we have Pat Heffernan around, we've lost our Pat Heffernan there. Pat, Pat, no stranger to the quiz, Pat, uh, Pat of course is representing Rat Muff here tonight. But Ben Pat. <laughs> You're down there, Pat. What man yourself, Pat? <laughs> okay, we have our three finalists here tonight for the quiz. Where in the parish? Uh, could we have Cunis from the hall, please? Just a quick check. Ca uh, Carmel, Pat, and Paddy. Uh, could we have a quick check that all the hands are in working order? <laughs> we have Paddy. We have Paddy. We have Paddy. Uh, we have Pat, Carmel. Right hand, go get Carmen. <laughs> Just to let you know, Carmen, Paddy and Pat, you will be penalised if you raise the wrong hand to answer a question here tonight. <gasps> okay, we have Curious from the Heart, please. We'll have our first question here tonight in where in the parish. <laughs> and our first question here tonight from the quick fire round questions. Could you tell me, Carmen, Paddy and Pat, could you tell me the odd man out at Tom Slattery's funeral? <laughs> Give me a chance, lads. They're not easy. They're not easy here tonight. Cunis mm. from the heart, please. Give him a chance there. <laughs> Camel straight in there, Camel. Billy Murphy. Billy Murphy's correct. Round of applause for Camel. Really, <laughs> Billy Murphy. Well done, Camel. 
Two minutes in the hall, please. Okay, Carmen, since you've answered the first part of that question correctly, I'll direct the second part of that question directly at you. Could you tell me, Carmel, why was he the odd man out? <laughs> If you're not in quick enough, Carmel, I'll have to pass it on. <laughs> Paddy, straight in there, Paddy. And Father, he was the odd man out shoulder the coffin, Father. Front right. left hand side, Billy Murphy, Father. Right. Front right hand side was Dan Slattery, brother deceased. Right. Middle right hand side shoulder the coffin was Dixie Slattery, a first cousin of deceased, Father. Right. Then back right hand side shoulder the coffin was Mixie Slattery, Father, another brother deceased. Right. Back left hand side shoulder the coffin then was Larry Slattery, a first cousin of deceased, Father. Right. Then middle left hand side shoulder and Father was Shawnee Slattery, Father, a brother of deceased. Right. And the odd man out was front left hand side, Father. Billy Murphy, Father, and the reason he was the odd man out, Father, is because he was no blood relation to the deceased at the time of the funeral, Father. And a round of applause for Penny. <laughs> 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 this move is on to our audio section. This is where I give the contestants an audio cue. I'll be looking for an answer and I'll be giving them a question. So could we have cue from the hall, please? And we'll have our first audio cue. <laughs> And the question we did. <laughs> that was the voice of the late Nana Long, Lord to mercy on Nana. <laughs> Could you tell me what did Nana die from and under what circumstances? <laughs> Lads, I'm after hearing it from this corner already. We'll have Cunis in the hall, please. You'll have to give him a chance up here. You'll be Cunis in the hall, please. <laughs> give him a chance, let's give him a chance. <laughs> Pat straight in there, Pat. Bronchitis. And a round of applause for Pat straight in there with bronchitis for Ben Paz. <laughs> it's very tight, there's no doubt about it, it's very tight. Pat, for the bonus pint in that section, could you tell me under what circumstances did Nana pass away, Lord Marciana? <laughs> if you're not in quick enough, Pat, I'll have to pass it on. Oh, <laughs> Paddy. Ah, uh, Father, the bad winter of 72, Father. Bronchitis, Father. And she was Casey herself, Father. <laughs> Oh, that right? oh, that's right, Father. She was Casey before she was long, Father. Yeah. She married into the longs out of the Casey's, Father. They came from the bog of Kildicken, Father. That's right. Oh, that's right. Oh, Jesus, Father, that was old damp, wet, soggy ground. You know what I mean? Yeah. But they suffered an awful lot, Father, from old TB consumption, old pneumonia, old colds, old flus, old runny noses, old bad backs, old weeping walls, old wet ground, old mist fog, bog rock, brambles, briars, crawling, scraping, misery, misfortune, hunger, starvation, emigration, pulling, dragging, tearing, muck, dirt, mulliking around, brambles, briars. Mulliking out, pulling and dragging and muck and sinking more rain and misery and misfortune and torture and pulling and dragging and and it, oh, but they were happy there, Father. Like that, me. They were happy there. Oh, they were happy there. And um, when she married in to the when she married into the lungs, Father, didn't she bring the bad chest with her out of the bog, Father? And she died during the bad winter of 72, Father. Bronchitis, Father. And the round of applause for Paddy. Straight in there with Bronchitis, but man, Paddy. <laughs> Which leads us to our final question here tonight in Where in the Parish. Now, quick check in the scoreboard there. We have Carmel Lyons at one pint. Uh, Pat Heffernan there at one pint. Paddy O'Leary there with two half bonus pints at one pint. So they're nicky nicky at this stage as we lead into our final question here tonight and the decider question in Where in the Parish. Cunis from the hall, please. Camel, Paddy, and Pat, could you tell me the strange circumstances surrounding the removal of Noel Nanbe? <laughs> Give me a chance, Ed. Give me a chance. <laughs> could you repeat the question, please, Father? <laughs> Could you tell me the strange circumstances surrounding the removal of Noel Nanbe? <laughs> camel, straight in there, Camel. The shooting of John F. Kennedy. I'm sorry, Camel, that's not the answer we were looking for. <laughs> I'll have to disqualify you from the quiz and throw it over to Pat and Paddy. They didn't suit you, Camel. They didn't suit you. No, they didn't. <laughs> Give me a chance. <laughs> Pat, straight in there, Pat. The county final. I'm disappointed, Pat. I'm sorry. No, I can't accept that. Uh, Paddy. Uh, father, the, um, the 50th anniversary of the 1916 Rising Father. 
and the year, Patty? <laughs> 66, Father. Right. And what happened was, Father, the funeral was pulling out of Leary's Lane, Father. And as the funeral was pulling out of Leary's Lane, wasn't the parade coming round the village for the 50th anniversary of the 1916 Rising, Father? There was marching bands and floats and banners and balloons, the whole lot, Father. And didn't the hearse get excommunicated from the rest of the funeral, Father? And it got swept away in the parade, Father. And it couldn't get out of the parade. And it had to go round the village about 10 or 15 times with the marching bands and floats and banners and balloons and everything. And wasn't it late for the graveyard, late for the rosary, late for the prayers, late for everything, Father? But, but didn't they end up winning the medal, Father? For the most unusual Float in the parade. And our own partner, Paddy Leary, our winner here tonight in Way in the Barrel, the main Paddy. Good luck, Paddy. Say hello to members, me, Paddy, won't you? A round of applause for Carmen Lyons and Paddy Everett, the young man. Good man. Say hello to my members, me, Paddy, won't you? Like a good man. Uh, Paddy, can I have a quick word with you, dear, please? I think we're nearly ready to start off. Could you get the girls from the Flagellate Band to line up there, I like, hope <laughs> uh, We're going to kick in now with some local talent. Starting up here, we'll have the girls from the local Flagellate Band will be starting up here. <laughs> there are children up sideline there. Uh, we'll also have some poetry there from Jimmy Ryan, uh, one of our local GAR stars. Uh, we also, uh, we, I think we have some... Uh, are the pipers are here? Yeah. And the set dancers? No, Father. Uh, we'll Sorry, Father. This, um, there's a lot of people out in the front of the house, Father, and they're beginning to complain. They're complaining, Father, because Kenny and Shot are not back on, Father. And there's a lot of people, and they're looking for their money back. <laughs> uh, I wonder, could you give a huge, uh, warm, rapturous round of applause to uh, two, uh, two lads that come down here, you've enjoyed them already, and uh, we're going to enjoy them once more again. So for the fabulous entertaining, uh, Pat Kenny and John Shot, a round 